Hey everybody, what's up? This is your nutritionist on the go, Kamal Deep Singh Ojala from Erudai Nutrition. So guys, first of all, I want to thank you, each and every one of you, everyone who saw the video that we posted about uh, the thyroid awareness campaign. Uh, thanks a lot. Uh, I, 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 am, I am greatly indebted to you guys, everyone who saw the video, everyone who commented and liked and everyone who shared the word and helped me spread the awareness about the thyroid disease and uh, even if we were able to help even a single person who was suffering from thyroid, even if he got educated and if he started to getting help, each and every one of you deserves credit for that. I am so much thankful to everyone. And uh, I got so many messages. Uh, they appreciated my effort and everybody was so happy. But some of them actually asked, is this going to continue? Is the awareness campaign, uh, campaign going to country continue? And uh, the answer to that question is definitely yes. You guys don't stop showing me love and appreciation. And I am not going to stop on spreading the awareness and uh, wherever the unethical practice of the medical world where they are not guiding uh, the patients properly we are going to stand against it all right and we are going to fight disease all united together so thank you everyone bless you all bless everyone who, who shared the video uh, so continuing the awareness campaign i have decided to make another video and uh, once again i need some precious time uh, from your side and a little bit of effort from your side you need to again help me spread the word participate equally and uh, let's see how many more people we can actually help so the topic for today is fatty liver a very common disease nowadays in, uh, in India and uh, the problem is many of the people don't even know that they are having a fatty liver disease so what you actually need to do is you need to you know either sit or stand straight okay and look down towards your belly okay so mine is flat you know a lot of transformation lost a lot of weight so if you see a bulging out belly okay there is a huge chance that you have a fatty liver okay please listen to me carefully again you stand up straight or you sit up straight and you see directly down towards your belly okay and if you have a protruding belly a hard one, a fluid filled tightness in your ribs and in your belly and it's protruding out like a, like a tube of a truck, you definitely have a fatty liver. What are, the, what are the signs do we have of a fatty liver? Yes, you are going to have serious problems in digestion. Your digestion is not as powerful. Uh, why, why is that so? Because, because your liver is fatty. There is so much of extra fat that has been stored in your liver. And what is the reason of the fat? The reason of that fat is not the dietary fats that you have been eating. It is not the butter, it is not the ghee, it is not the sarsoka tail or anything like that. It is the refined sugars that you have been eating ever since you were born. See, eating sugar is a culture. Okay, eating refined sugars in form of jaggery or refined sugar or brown sugar or uh, honey. All of these are refined sugars. Eating refined carbohydrates like pasta, bread, crackers, cereals, all these things, breakfast cereals to be specific, that, those that are made up from corn, uh, cornflakes especially. All these refined sugary cereals, refined carbohydrates, are the cause of your fatty liver now the fatty liver is of two types guys number one is alcoholic fatty liver people who drink too much alcohol and number two uh, it is called non-alcoholic fatty liver and it is caused by sugars now try to understand a little bit of science over here alcohol and sugars are almost the same thing okay alcohols is just another form of of sugar simple sugars okay it might not taste like sugars but it definitely is a sugar a type of a sugar okay so what happens is when you eat too much sugar or you eat or you drink too much alcohol all that refined sugar raises up your blood glucose your insulin comes to lower that uh, rise in your blood glucose all the fat is being all the so all the sugars is being converted into fats and stored in your belly region and especially when you keep on eating sugars, when you keep on abusing your body with alcohol and sugars, 
a cert, a, a, after a certain amount of uh, fats being accumulated in your belly, your liver starts to get fatty. The liver cells start storing fats in them. Okay, so that's when you have a fatty liver or a stage of liver cirrhosis. Now, why is fatty liver so dangerous? Because it's affecting your liver and your liver has more than 500 functions. So many enzymes, so many uh, mineral metabolisms, so many uh, uh, vitamin metabolism and all the macros everything is being metabolized by your liver or uh, many of the proteins especially the bile bile is uh, the salt that uh, helps you break down fats and take out all the fat soluble vitamins uh, from your diet so when this gets dis disrupted because your efficiency after being a fatty liver decreases okay so it is going to cause all sorts of problem now, where, why, why haven't the fatty liver caused an abnormality in my blood test? Many must be thinking. Because liver is such an organ, until and unless it reaches its last stage of damage, it won't show any signs in your blood test. Okay? Until and unless your liver is 90% damaged, scarred, it will not show any sign in your blood work you might have to go for an ultrasound scan of your liver okay your liver is on the right side okay it's, it's a pretty big organ so in that ultrasound you can easily see the scarring uh, the cirrhosis the the damage of uh, the cells of liver so nobody bothers you know getting a scan for their liver ultrasound for their liver so uh, the the only easy option we have is just see if you have a protruding belly there is a huge chance that you have a fatty liver so guys you need a nutritionist in your life asap why because see to get rid of a fatty liver you need to lose that belly you need to lose that weight but now your body is not going to burn fat that efficiently. You might go to a gym, you might buy a cycle or a treadmill and you start working off as hard as you can, start eating clean, but it is not going to help because your liver is not doing its work properly. It has been scarred. Your liver is damaged. You need professional help for that. Now, I am not recommending you to come to me or it's, it's not my motive. But if you want to consult me, I am always available to guide you. You can go to any other nutritionist or dietitian, who, whoever you feel uh, you are comfortable in talking, who can listen to your problem, who can give you a nice scientific solution. Now, number two thing that you don't have to do is, if you ever go to a doctor or a dietitian or a nutritionist, and the guy says, okay, you have a fatty liver, so you need to stop taking in your fats. Any person who stops you taking, who, who, who says that you have to avoid your fats completely, trust me guys, do not believe him. Because your fatty liver is not caused by fats, it is caused by sugars. And if the nutritionist guides you that you have to stop your sugars, then that's a genuine person, you can trust on him, okay? Otherwise, uh, don't waste your time on that. Go to a professional or even I nutrition is always available for you, okay? So guys, please help me spread the message again i request you all to dig deep in your family circle to dig deep in your friend circle any person with a protruding belly can be there is an 80 percent chance that he can be a person with a scarred liver okay and it won't show until it is fully damaged so please help me spread this awareness uh, please if you can share this video as much as possible guide people help people and uh, let's let's spread this awareness against fatty liver okay guys thank you so much in advance you bless you all and uh, i hope you enjoy the sunday eat clean stay healthy be motivated and let's let's make a commitment that we are going to help other people as well okay you can help me by spreading my word and i'm trying my level best to provide uh, nutritional help and nutritional no knowledge to the common people but i cannot do it with the without the support of you guys i need each and every one of you to participate equally and let's spread this word together signing off this was your nutritionist on the go kamal deep singh from erudite nutrition everybody have a blessed sunday take care eat healthy rest well do exercise and uh, i'll see you guys next time take care